Hi guys, welcome back to another video. We're here today, and today we're going to be reviewing Premier League Match Day 15 in over in England in the soccer. We're going to be going on to the Premier League app and reviewing and previewing this upcoming football that needs to be addressed. That That's Match Day 16, but... We won't worry about that. We'll worry about what's happening. We what has happened. There, so they're the results, as you can see. That's from Friday, the 6th of December. Sheffield versus Newcastle. Sheffield United versus Newcastle United. Alan St. Maximum with the first goal for Newcastle United. With the assist by, I can't say that. And Jono Shelby with the 70th minute goal, assisted by Andy Carroll. Referee was Stuart Atwell. Attendance was 30,409. Billy Sharp and Luke Freeman received yellow cards for the, for the Blades. And Josh Lundstram was the man of the match. This is the this is the um the play by play analysis Goal Alan set maximum headed from the box into the bottom right corner with a cross with the assist Half time it's 1-0 Goal, Sheffield United to nil, Newcastle to Jono Shelby, Newcastle United. Right foot shot from the centre of the box to the bottom corner. Assisted by Andy Carroll with a headed pass. Goal confirmed following the VAR review. Full time. 2-0 to, to the Mags. The Mag. This was a classic game. This was fantastic. I was so happy when I, I was at school when this finished, and I was like, Brighton have won, Brighton have won, Brighton have won. And Adam Webster with the first goal for Brighton in the first half. Then and Alexandra Lacazette from 50. And Neil Maupay. I might have got that wrong. With the second goal for Brighton. Aaron Moy. The Aussie. With the assist. To the last goal. And another Aussie. Matt Ryan was the king of the match. Play by play analysis. Would have been it would have been two, but Matt Ryan was just so awesome. Goal! Arsenal one, Arsenal nil, Brighton one. Adam Webster, Brighton and Hope of Albion. Right-footed shot from the centre of the box to the bottom left corner, following a corner. Goal! Arsenal one, Brighton one. Andrew Alexandra Lacazette header from the centre of the box to the top corner, assisted by Meza Özil with it following a corner. Goal for Brighton, Arsenal 1, Brighton 2. Header from the centre of the box to the bottom right corner, assisted by Aaron Moy, Aaron Aaron Moy, with a cross. Full time, 1-2 to two to Brighton. Yes. Oh 
And former Aston Villa man striked first for Chelsea. At Chelsea, what? Oh, Chelsea 2, sorry. Oh, and Villa 1. Tammy Abraham, 24 minutes. Assisted by Rhys James. In four minutes before the half. Villa get a goal. And Mason Mount with another goal. Tammy Abraham again. Chelsea youth persisting from Frank Lampard. First half. Goal, Chelsea 1, Villa 0. Tammy Abraham, Chelsea, headed from the box to the high corner, high centre of the goal, assisted by Reese James with a cross for Chelsea. Goal, Chelsea 1, Villa 1. Aston Villa left foot. From a very close range to the bottom corner. Goal, Mason Mount. Right-footed shot from the centre of the box to the top corner. Assisted by Tammy Abraham. Full time, Chelsea 1, Villa... Villa uh, sorry, Chelsea 2, Villa 1. Jamie Vardy, king of the match was Jamie Vardy. Jamie Vardy, yellow card. Jamie Vardy, penalty. James Maddinson. The play-by-play -play analysis. All of it was the second half. Second half was interesting. Half time. Leicester nil, Watford nil. And the second half's underway. Goal, Jamie Vardy converts the penalty from a foul from a shot to the bottom corner. Goal, 2 0, James Maddinson. Left footed shot from the centre of the box to the centre of the goal, assisted by James Justin with a header pass. Oh, yes. Jose Mourinho's Tottenham couldn't outdo Manchester United. Results are coming soon for that one. Marcus Rashford, six minutes, penalty. 49 minutes, penalty. And Dele Alli, 39 minutes, penalty. A uh, goal, sorry. Scored two penalties, though. First half, goal, Man United 1, Tottenham nil. Marcus Rashford, right-footed shot from the left side of the box to the bottom corner. Goal, Man United 1, Tottenham 1, Dele Alli with a right-footed shot from the right side of the six-yard box towards the bottom corner. Goal confirmed following the VAR review. Goal, 2-1 to Man United. Marcus Rashford converts penalty with a right-footed shot to the bottom corner. Full-time, 2-1 to Manchester. Southampton 2, Norwich 1 at St Mary's Stadium. Kevin Friend, who's a big friend of Southampton. Danny Ings and... Ryan Bertrand and Timu Puki, goal scorers. I was, was listening to that on Southampton Radio Channel. First half begins. Goal, Southampton 1, Norwich now. Danny Ings with a tap from very close range to the centre of the goal. Assisted by James Ward-Price with a cross setting up. Set from a set-up piece situation. Goal 2-0 to the Saints. Ryan Bertrand, right foot cross from very close range from bottom corner. Assisted by Shane Long following a corner. 2-0 at half time. Pukki scores for, for Norwich. Saints 2, Norwich 1. Timu Pukki, left foot shot from the left side 
to the top corner. Full time 2-1. Come on you Saints. At Molyneux. 2-1 to the Wolves. Where the Wolves, where the Wolves, where the Wolves, where the Wolves, where the Wolves. Um, late goal. No one I really know. I don't really follow any of these teams. First half begins. Goal 1-0 to Wolverhampton Wanderers. Right foot shot from very close range to the bottom corner. Half time, it's 1 0 to the Wolves. Goal, 2 0 Wolves. Right foot shot from, cent from centre of the box to the bottom corner. Assisted by Pedro Neto. What a strange name. Full time, it's 2 0. And they got what they deserved, the Wolves. I think it's the Mercy side? No. I don't know what it's called, but it's some derby. It's always been a, it's a good game, but this one wasn't. This was a one-sided derby to the, the Reds and not to the Blues. Um, Divock Origi, Shakiri, Sadio Mane and Wijnaldum for Liverpool. Five. Everton. Michael Keane and Richarlison have their two goals. No, we don't really want Everton. We want Liverpool. Come on, you Reds. Lots to talk about here. As half time, full, uh, sorry, start. Goal, Liverpool one, Everton nil. Divock Origi left foot shot from the bot from the centre of the box to bottom corner. Assessed by Sadio Mane. Three from a ball from a fast break. Goal, Shakiri, Left foot shot from the centre of the box to the bottom right corner. Assisted by Sadio Mane. Again with a through ball. Goal, Everton have a goal. Liverpool 2, Everton 1. Michael Keane. Everton, right foot shot from the, from the right side of the six yard box. To the high centre of the goal. Following a corner. Goal. Divock Origi again. Right foot shot from the centre of the box. To the high corner of the goal. Assisted by Dejan Lovren. With a through ball. Right on half time. Everton. Liverpool 4. Everton 1. Sadio Mane again. He's been very influential. That's why he's the king of the match. Left foot shot from outside of the box to the bottom corner. Assisted by Trent Alexander-Arnold. Following a fast break. Goal, Liverpool. Uh, Everton finally score just before half-time. It's Richarlison with an attempt from the centre of the box to the bottom right corner. Goal confirmed following a VAR. 4-2 half-time. Goal, Divock Origi. No, sorry. Wijnaldum. Right foot shot from the centre of the box to the bottom right corner. Assisted by Famino. Palace 1, Bournemouth 0. And... Red card... So, we will be talking about the second half. First half, sorry. Red card. Palace player. I don't know how to pronounce that. It was showing the red. Half time, it's nil nil. Goal. 1 nil. Palace. Left foot shot from outside of the box for the goal. Assisted by James MacArthur. 1-0 Palace. They deserve the, all the credit they got there. To put to Palace. Gabriel Jesus. What a player. 1-4. To, uh, to Manchester City. 
First half. Goal, 24 minutes. Gabriel Jesus, 0-1 to City. Right foot shot from the left side of the box to the bottom corner, assisted by David Silva. Half time, 1-0. 50 minutes, 2-0. Gabriel Jesus, right foot shot from very close range to top corner, assisted by Bernardo Silva with a cross. Goal, 3-0, Rodrigo. Right foot shot from outside the box to the top corner. Goal, 4-0. Riyad Mahrez, right foot shot outside of the box, assisted by Bernardo Silva to the top corner. Goal! Burnley finally had one. Robbie Brady, left foot shot from outside of the box to the top corner, assisted by Jeff Hendrick. 1-4 at Turf Moor. Now the Premier League table now stands with Liverpool... On top by eight points. And at the bottom, Newcastle have moved. Brighton have moved. Southampton have moved. At the bottom, Norwich, Everton and, sorry, Everton, Norwich and Watford all in the, in the bottom. Southampton need to get on a winning run so they can escape the season. And now we go to the latest. Match week 16 in the Premier League kicks off tonight at 23.30, which is 11.30 Australian time. With the Blues, Everton taking on also the Blues, Chelsea. With their new manager, Everton. At Goodison Park, Bournemouth versus Liverpool. Tomorrow at 2 a.m. in the morning at Vitality Stadium. Vitality Stadium? Yes, Vitality Stadium. Spurs Burnley at. Um, what's the new stadium called? Tottenham Hotspur Stadium at 2 a.m. in the morning as well. Watford Palace also at 2 a.m. in the morning. Palace easy win. And the Manchester Derby. 4 a.m. in the morning at Etihad Stadium. It's going to be a classic game. I'm going to be so happy if we win. Monday 9th of December, they've got 1 a.m. in the morning. They've got Aston Villa versus Leicester City Foxes at Villa Park. St. James's Park now. Newcastle United. Versus Southampton at 1. Also at 1, Sheffield United will be going to Norwich. And taking on Norwich at Carrow Road. Also at 1. Brighton Wolves at 3.30. At, I have no clue, Amex Stadium it's called. The most convenient time is actually Tuesday, December the 10th. Arsenal versus West Ham United at West Ham's London Stadium. There are all our fixtures we have for this round. Obviously, this is going to be a big round for pushing a lot of players in, a lot of teams in and out of the league in positions and different areas. And, um, I I just want Saints to stay up and um Newcastle to stay up. Man United to do well and I reckon Leicester City are gonna win the league. I don't know how they're gonna do that with the Liverpool's current form, but you know what? If Liverpool win I won't be too unhappy. But um Yeah, that's our preview, ladies and gentlemen. Um Uh Make sure you go and subscribe and um, make sure you go and hit that like button. I'll be so unhappy if you don't hit that like button. Like, the like button is so big, so important to me. And um, and um, I really appreciate any like feedback or comments. Thank you.